Your Excellency, the Deputy President, all protocols observed. Uh, my name is Precious Damarandu, the Assistant County Commissioner, Matangoni Division in Kilifi North Sub County in Kilifi County. Uh, one major challenge that has to be looked with a lot of sobriety of mind is the operation of mang mangoes, uh, which are Nazi dens. Pop popularly known as uh, uh, mangoes, the designated places where we have Nazi sale and consumption of Nazi. Nazi is legalized, but most of these operators, they operate with a lot of impunity. There should be a law, or rather the county government should come up with a law to regulate specifically the time of operation, specifically the location of these mango dens, specifically what is to be sold in these mangoes and to whom it's sold. And I'll give an example of where uh, a, a mangue and tumesikia pia kutoka kwa governor wa, wa kwale akisema kwamba hapa kuna rehabilitation center nyuma yake kuna, kuna mangue it, it, it's all over here in coast where we have uh, the time of operating these mangues mlevi anakuja kwa boma mangue yuko kwa boma ya, ya mahali watu wanaishi mlevi anakuja kwa boma Mama alikesha kiuza hii pombe, mtoto wa shule ameamka anaenda shule, lakini anaambiwa wewe e, save huyu mlevi alafu uende shule. Akifika shule kuna mangu ambayo yuko karibu e, na, na shule. Mlevi anaimba, mwalimu naye anafundisha. So it's important that the county government just to complement the national law on, on liquor, we have a commitment from the county government that uh, uh, regulates these mangues. Specifically, ni mesema time, location, what to sell and to whom. Ili tuweze kusaidia watu wetu. But generally, we are very grateful and we are committed as the Ngao team to ensure that uh, uh, our area, the coast region, is free from drug and substance abuse. Thank you. Thank you, Madam SEC. Mr. Abdallah. His Excellency the Deputy President, uh, all protocols observed. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, good afternoon. Yes, our um, uh, lady Abdallah is sorry, uh, I missed that name, yes, but uh, it's still me refers to me. Thank you for that. Yeah, uh, first and foremost, I'd like to appreciate uh, our Lord for giving us this auspicious occasion where we have come to discuss an idea whose time has uh, come. And uh, we have to accept that uh, it is a menace in this whole country. And I appreciate so much on uh, the, the action taken by our, uh, our leader, that is exactly the president, in ensuring that uh, we talk about this and uh, we look for a way forward. No blame game. We ensure that uh, uh, we discuss on the way to assist our nation. Uh, Mombasa, as a county, uh, this menace is there and we cannot lie to ourselves. And it is a commitment that we have to take as OCSs and leaders of stations. Let us take responsibility and see that we put our best foot forward to ensure that we fight this with the intensity that it requires. Uh, on the challenges, all of them have been mentioned, especially uh, from the ODPP side, where we see that uh, most of the cases are not registered because of the quantity. Uh, judiciary uh, being too lenient. On the, uh, on the perpetrators, therefore not uh, giving any deterring measures. They will come out of the court having paid uh, fines and continue with the same business. Also on the county government, they have a responsibility to take, especially on matters of licensing. We see there is an abuse of this uh, liquor, is it a hotel and restaurant, a bar and restaurant uh, license, where the uh, proprietors really abuse the same. We know the conditions that has uh, someone has to fulfill uh, to get her uh, to register a business like that. But we see in Mombasa County, uh, licenses are, uh, are applied online. So even the one who is in the office does not even know where the business is located. So if we can go back to the basics, see that uh, every licensing uh, authority should go to, down to the ground to know what is going on. Where is this business located? Is it near our school? near a religious institution? Is it posting any security threat 
to the uh, public who are there. Because we see abuse of these uh, drugs and substance equally is directly proportional to the uh, increase in crime rate in uh, this county. So let us all uh, do this together and we will achieve the best results that we can achieve. And if we talk about a multifaceted approach, if we talk about multi-agency approach, let us not do it, in, do it in offices. Let us not do it in forums. Let us do it on the ground. We will talk about it here, but when we go back to the ground, the donkey work is left to the OCSs. It is us who are going for raids. It is us who are doing all this. We are the ones who are gathering intelligence. It is the us who are looking for information. Let us all take responsibility and see that uh, we are moving this nation in, uh, in the best uh, direction that is possible. Thank, Thank you. you so much. And God bless everybody. Now, on behalf of the religious community, uh, I would want to invite an imam to say something. Is there an uh, imam or a sheikh? Okay, any religious leader who wants to say something so that we close this... Uh, Can, can we give the microphone to the imam? <laughs>